In 2022, Uganda lost at least 17,000 people to HIV AIDS, a figure still relatively high, according to Uganda AIDS Commission. Every week, Uganda registers at least 1,000 new HIV infections, which amounts to at least 142 new HIV cases daily. Uganda's current statistics show that at least 1.2 million people out of 1.4 million HIV patients are on antiretroviral drugs, which is a positive development. It's critical to note that HIV is still with us in Uganda and it is still a threat. In 2022, Uganda lost 17,000 people. You know, a whole year you lose 17,000 people to HIV AIDS. It's a lot. To HIV related illness compared to 48,000 in 2010. Of course, there was relative improvement from 48,000 to 17,000. But 17,000 is still a big figure. Every week, you can register 1,000 new infections. That's a translates in 242 persons per week, per day. And this is approximately six people per hour. 7% of new infections among the young. 70% of new infections among young people we are docents. Dr. Eddie Mukoya of Uganda AIDS Commission says that research has shown that men are still not compliant to HIV testing, which makes them potential spreaders of HIV, especially to young girls. The studies are showing us that men, in terms of uh, accessing treatment, don't want to access treatment. The prevalence currently, it did reduce from 18% in the early 1980s to now, which is about 5.6%. Chamogo University, a premier university in Uganda, has integrated a robust HIV fighting strategy in their academic programs aimed at raising awareness about HIV and fighting stigmatization. We are all aware that HIV AIDS is an issue of national concern and it equally affects the learners and our students. The university put into place a health and safety policy in which the HIV policy is embedded and that is exactly what guides us in run-up to the prevention and ending HIV AIDS by 2030. People rarely test for HIV, so I think those are some of the causes. People don't know their status, but then they are willing to engage into sexual intercourse. And so you find that they join peer groups that uh, make them exposed. You find you have a roommate or a friend who is having more than two boyfriends or sugar daddies, and uh, that is the first point whereby you have multiple sex partners. In 2017, President Yoel Museveni launched a presidential fast-track initiative on ending HIV-AIDS in Uganda by 2030. CRISPRs, Arinitwe, YBC News.